Victims of child sexual abuse are among the most vulnerable um, and poignant victims in our society. And it, it affects, like all crimes, not just the child, but the whole family and the community. Sometimes there are physical signs, you know, unexplained illnesses or emotional signs that a child is being abused. When you see a kid withdraw, become fearful, lose self-confidence, demonstrate anxiety, you should find out what the source of those symptoms might be. There is help available and there are resources that are appropriate for children and that's really key. Around the country there are a number of child advocacy centers where child victims of sex abuse can come and it's a one-stop shop where a child can get social services, can get referrals for medical services, can be interviewed by trained forensic interviewers who know how to talk to children, who know how to work with children in a sensitive way, and who can do one interview that can be used by the social workers, the prosecutors, the police, so this poor kid doesn't have to tell the story over and over and over again.